Yeah, all right, lads. So today we're going to be viewing Inform Osana Diara on Marseille in the Liga Earn. He's five foot eight tall, right footed. He's got medium high work rate, a three star weak foot, and two star skills. Current price range is in 9.9k to 110k. That is on Xbox and on the PlayStation as well. So looking at his in games, he stand out to 88 stand tackle, 88 aggression, 88 stamina, 85 interceptions, and 83 marking. We have also included all the upgrades over his non inform as comparison, like we always do, so you can compare between the two. So you can always pause it for a close look at any of these stats now. So this is the team we used to made a 4-2-3-1 league earned side with informed the arrow there at left centre defensive mid. So now onto the gameplay, so you can see how he was performing for me. Now Diara, he was a bit of a surprise inclusion in this week's team of the week. Did pop up out of nowhere, but I do enjoy the league earned, so I did want to give him a try. And he does actually have some good pace and decent agility and dribbling. So he does make a good mobile centre defensive mid, who can actually uh, bring the ball up through midfield without many worries whatsoever. Solid dribbling on him, and he does have that 83 short and 80 long pass, so he's a great passer of the ball as well. Is strangely weak though, which I really think isn't right in my opinion. I really do think he should have more than 56 strength, which is a bit poor for Diara. And he is short as well, at 5 foot so I would not really recommend him as a lone CDM. I do tend to like my defenders to have a bit high and a lot more strength than 56. But he does work well in a per as we were using him in that 4-2-3-1. It's a great formation. He does need a bit of help. Even though he has great defensive stats though, does have that 88 stand tackle, 88 uh, aggression and 83 marking. So great at breaking up play in the middle, but does probably need a little bit of help there with his strength and his height. He needs that extra player to back him up with that heading. Now shooting wise, Diara is really poor, does have awful finishing, but surprisingly enough, he did actually get on the score sheet. He did use that dribbling well to get into a great shooting chance, and he actually did manage to bang the ball in. A bit lucky there, as he's shooting, as we said, really, really poor. I wouldn't suggest trying many shots with Diara though, as most will not be hitting the mark. You do have to get in an absolute uh, bang on chance, or really lucky to get a goal with Diara. So let's look at Inform Diara's performance stats. So in eight games, he did actually manage to grab two goals despite that poor shooting. Did grab two assists as well from CDM. All the stat information is on the left, goal information on the right. That position map bottom right does show you where the goals are scored and assists were created from as well. So overall, we're going to give Inform Diara a solid 7.8 out of 10. It does make a good option at CDM. And now he does have that pace and the dribbling. So great mobile defensive mid, as we said. Great defensive stats on him as well. Solid defensively. My only concern is that height and strength. But was fine in that two CDM formation. Can get forward, but does have that poor shooting. So try and stick to the creative game with Diara. Leave that shooting to his teammates, as we said. Really is a struggle to get goals. And it was a real struggle to get those couple of goals for you on them clips best leave it to your teammates as we said really not a shooter more of a defensive player with his medium high where it's as well currently around 16k which for me is worth picking up at that price for a french national side or of course a league earned side so finally we're just going to leave you with informed the arrows positive negatives to look at now his main negatives are obviously that height and strength obviously shooting is poor but that is not his primary function really brilliant cdm great defensively other than that height and strength he is going to be getting you the tackles will cut out a lot of ball in the middle really recommended if you can get him for 15k or under he's good on the ball is a decent playmaker and especially for a cdm well worth a try in my opinion especially if he does drop to this guard then it's always Definitely, definitely worth picking him up. Decent player to have, especially for Marseille fans out there or in the Liga Earn side as well. So please smash a like if you do enjoy the video. It really does help a lot. And please subscribe if you're new. Loads more in-depth squad builders and reviews to come. So stay tuned for them. Thanks a lot for watching, lads. I really do appreciate it. Cheers, lads. See you later.